Hey y'all, today I'm gonna be installing this half feed in, half full lock, full lace wig that I made using some spring twist hair that I got from the Beverly store on Amazon. So if you're interested in watching, go ahead and stay tuned. Say I'm proud of you. You don't have bumps in Africa along the way. So let's just jump right into the video. Today I'm going to be installing a full lace wig that I made using this spring twist hair that I got from the Beverly store on Amazon. This is their 12 inches spring twist crochet braiding hair for butterfly locks, three pack shoulder length balm twist for black women, blonde synthetic hair extensions 613. This is the color 613 and I got the 12 inch three pack order. They also have some other colors available as well as the 16 inch length. More information and the link to purchase is in my description box below if you're interested. All right, so when I got my package, it came with the three packs of the 12 inch spring twist hair, a crochet needle and some rubber bands. To prepare this hair to make the wig, all I did was stretch out each strand like this. The hair was soft and it was easy to pull apart. And these are what the strands are looking like after I was done stretching them all. For this wig, I'm using the faux lock wig that I made in a previous video. I'm gonna loose out those locks. And I went ahead and washed it. And I did this wig off camera um, because I didn't have much storage space and I was trying to get this wig done. So I went ahead and did some very small, um, I guess, micro faux locks with some box parts in the back section. And then in the front section, I did some feed in braids and some rubber band connected braids and I left the big baby hairs. All right, so to start the install, I got my She Is Bomb Collection Tinted Foam in the color Sweet Caramel. I, I think it's Sweet Caramel, I can't remember. It'll be in the description box below if you're interested. But I squared that into the cap and then I got a makeup brush and I dabbed that into the whole lace of this wig. So it's a full lace with the like elastic cap in the middle. So I put the foam on all of that and then I blow dried it. And I'm not even gonna show y'all what my hair looking like, but put the wig on with the cap. I'm not doing a bald cap because I didn't plan on keeping this wig on for very long. I'm not too comfortable with the color to be honest, but whatever. Anyways, so yeah, I'm just trying it on to make sure it fit properly. And now I'm getting my ghost bond glue and I'm just putting a couple of layers on there. I'm not even waiting until it dry all the way. Like I said, I don't plan on keeping this wig on long. Um, so I put the glue on, blow dried it a little bit, set the wig down, and then I just pressed it into my head. So you can see no edges are being taken out because I'm putting the glue above my hairline, like in front of my hairline. Now, when I'm done pressing all of that down, I'm gonna go ahead and blow dry it a little bit, and then I'm gonna put some Gotta Be Free spray and tie it down. All right, so now that it's dry, I'm gonna go ahead and try to fix the baby hairs up a little bit. I got my She Is Bomb Collection Bomb Glue Gel on the tip of my red tail comb, and I'm just putting it on the very beginning of the like sections uh, for the baby hairs, just to like give it some direction. And when I'm done with that, for the finishing touches, I'm gonna go ahead and grab my LA Girl Pro Concealer in the color Fawn and go in between the parts and on the edges of the lace. And this is the finished look. It's pretty cute. Like, I really like the style. It's just the color, mm, I don't know, whatever. But anyways, I really like this wig. I like how it turned out. I love how flexible these locks are. Um, the wig is not too heavy at all. And yeah, this wig came out very, very, very full. No, I didn't glue down the back. I didn't tie on the back 
braid down the back, sit down the back. I didn't do nothing to the back, so it's just hanging. But anyways, really cute wig. This just it's just this color. I don't know. I don't know what it's doing with me with 613 color. But yeah. Big shout out to Beverly Star on Amazon for sending me the 613 Spring Tooth hair to review. I have more information and a link to purchase in my description box below if you're interested. And I want to give a big shout out to everyone who is supporting Styles by Honey. I love y'all so, so much. Thanks for watching my video today, guys. Mm -hmm.